Hey guys, what's up? It's Fern. Welcome to another video. I am out and about, outside of the home. This is a rare occasion indeed. I actually just pulled up to a nursery because I need a few more cactus for the cactus garden that we're going to be building today. <clears throat> so I have some cactus at home that I want to use for the cactus garden, but um, they're mostly just tall, singular ones, and I want to get... There's so many people here right now. It's so busy. This is like not an ideal time for me to be here doing this um but i want some cactus that are more just like the kind of clustery type do you know what i mean um to kind of like even it out so it's not just a bunch of tall ones um so i'm gonna go take a look here i'm at green thumb if you're on the island i'm gonna see what they have i also will probably go to little tree after um i just wanted to check out both so yeah let's go see hopefully i'll be able to get some footage because if it's really busy in there i'm gonna be like too awkward um to film wish me luck i hate going to places when they're busy okay well that was a bit of a bust um yeah so there was basically nothing they only had like a few succulents for houseplants, they only had like half a table because it's all just outdoor gardening plants right now. Um, so that's good to know. I went there because in the past they've had tons of cool like succulents. Um, but yeah, not today. That's okay. And it's so busy. I couldn't even film. Like there was nothing to really film, but I couldn't even film um, like the table of succulents because I was literally like crammed between two people and like you have to follow the arrows on the ground and I like... I couldn't really stop um yeah it wasn't like the most relaxing plant shopping experience i was in there for like five minutes and it's already full of cars the parking lot is just getting more packed by the minute this is friday of may long of may long weekend so really an awful time for me to be going to any type of garden shop because people are probably getting ready to be spending their weekend <laughs> gardening oh stupid of me to film this today but whatever i'm gonna go to little tree um i love little tree and yeah i think that that's gonna be better so i'm gonna head over there now and hopefully we score some cactus okay plant shop number two i have a good feeling that we'll find some here Success, my friends. Okay, so the ones that I got are right down there on the floor. I am going to go straight home now. I'm really hot, I need to change, get the sweater off, and then I will show you what I got and we will plant the cactus garden. Okay, so it is the next day. I actually tried to film this part of the video once yesterday and once today. And um, the reason I wasn't able to is because I was trying to film it outside because I thought that would be really nice um, to plant this cactus garden, but it's just not gonna happen in my neighborhood, especially not on a weekend. So we're just gonna do it inside, um, but that's fine. So these are the cactus that I have collected. I'm a little worried it's not gonna be full enough. I don't know. Um, this is the planter. Oh, it's quite heavy that we're going to be using. It is this like terracotta-esque oval planter. It's very beautiful. I love this planter. I got it for only like $15 at Little Tree. I bought this thing in like, oh, how's a sticker? I bought this in the winter um, because I loved it and I have been saving it to do the cactus garden. Um, and I've also been saving some of these cactus that I hauled from Valley Succulent a few months ago. So we're finally doing it. I actually just watched Peanuts Plants, um, Sarah, her video on doing a cactus garden and hers turned out so nice. It was really like, she had a lot in there. So that's why I'm getting a little nervous that mine is not gonna be as full 
Um, but yeah, and I did also get some tips from her video. I think she was using some tongs. And I was also watching Dea. Um, I get so many tips from other YouTubers, it's so handy, but um, Dea's video, she was repotting, I think it was a variegated Opuntia, and she was using an oven mitt. Um, and I only have one pair of oven mitts that I didn't want to get full of spines, but we do have this little thing, so I thought maybe it might help. <laughs> it's like silicone. Um, but yeah, so I, I can link both of their videos down below as well. Alright, so I think that I have all of my supplies. I have mixed some, um, this is just a bag of Pro Mix cactus, uh, soil mix, I guess. But I added some more perlite to it to make it a little more well draining. I really wanted to get the Valley Succulent mix because um, it was finally in stock at the plant stores. But I decided that I should use up the one that I have before I buy that. So that's what I'm going to be using. And I'm not worried about overwatering them. If anything, I neglect my cactus. So I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, I don't even know how to get started here. I guess I should organ like plan how I want them to be in here. I wonder if I can like pop them in. No, the things are gonna be way too big. Um, okay, so <laughs> I hope that these tall ones aren't gonna look too out of place. Maybe I'll point the camera down and then I'm just gonna try to plan how I want these to be. Okay, so. Okay, so I think that this is how I want it to act. Ow! Oh my god. <laughs> this is not gonna go well. Um, I think that this is how I want it to look. This is gonna be the layout. So, I'm just gonna start by putting some soil. Let me move these. And <laughs> my Rubbermaid tote is going to be a table. Hopefully it's gonna be sturdy enough though. Can you imagine if this just collapsed in there? Okay, so we've got a pretty good layer down in there, so let's just begin. I guess I will do the ones in the back first, maybe. So the first one is this guy, the Golden Torch Cactus. Um, I am going to put the names on the screen instead of trying to pronounce all of them. Um, Okay, oh boy. I think I'll probably reuse this soil. I'm just gonna dump it into my thing, my bowl. are gonna be able to see maybe I'll tilt it like that so you can see both rows okay we're not going for perfection here next this is one of my favorite ones this is the variegated opuntia I have another one I'm not sure if it's the same type or if there's different types or not this one's not super spiky one. 
this little guy. Look how cute he is. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. I think I need to put a little bit more soil in his spot. Looks like he needs a little booster seat. so cute okay one more big one in the back here over a bit to fit this one in the back. Okay, wow, that took a lot of focus. Um, I think it's okay. I ended up having to move him over there because there was just no room where he was. Um, I will show you it all when I turn it around, but I'm just gonna fill up the spaces with soil.
Okay, so this is what it's looking like. It looks okay. I feel like maybe it could use something there, but also this is like pretty crowded considering the root systems and everything, so I don't know. I think it's okay. This guy is growing quickly, uh, which is good because he needs to get a little bit taller. Join the other tall boys in the back row. Yeah, I'm going to take a little brush now and get the soil off of them, and then I will show you the finished result. Okay, I think I'm gonna try to make a last minute adjustment and add this guy right there. I'm gonna see if I can fit him in. Um, yeah, I just feel like it's a little empty right there. Oh, that's good. This is gonna be good. Okay. Okay, it's all watered. It's actually growing on me how it looks. I think it's pretty cute. I was just seeing if it would fit up here on the windowsill, but it's too wide, so I think I'm going to put it outside on the deck for now. But yeah, very cute. All right guys, that is going to be it for this video. I just have to clean up this big mess now. So that is what I am about to do. Let me know what you think of the cactus garden. I am gonna keep it out on the deck for the summer or outside for the summer as much as I can. I'll probably bring it in when it's um, raining a lot. But yeah, I can't wait to see it grow and flourish hopefully over the summer. I think it would also be fun to do a succulent or even a euphorbia arrangement as well, but we shall see. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a like if you liked it. Leave me a comment down below. I would love to chat with you and make sure you subscribe to my channel for more planty content. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.